Download the Local 3 News and Weather apps now. Looking for a new home can be an exciting but also very stressful time, even in the best of circumstances. And it's no secret that these days are not exactly the best of circumstances. But Jason Carr with Onward Chattanooga says the numbers are not entirely bleak. He's an optimistic guy and he's sharing some positive news with us this morning. So good to see you. You too, Julie. You Thank know, you. all things in life, perspective is key, right? It is. So your perspective is you're looking at the month of July and you're comparing that to the month of June. June. So nothing has gotten worse, hasn't gotten better, but we're pretty even keel. We're pretty close to even as of last June, uh, or this June, I should say. You know, um, July, we're down a uh, couple of points mm -hmm. in pen, pending sales. Mm -hmm. So uh, like July's month was 912. July of last year was 944. Okay. Yeah. So typically, we're going to kind of go through a few things to let you yeah. see for yourself because Jason's a big believer in looking kind of at the facts, not the emotions. emotions. So let's start with pending sales. That yeah. means houses in the area that are under contract. Under contract, just waiting on closing date. Okay. All the contingencies have been removed. Okay, I never really got an A in graph reading, but I'll give it a whirl uh, this morning. So you take a look at that and you see that, what are we comparing, July? So July, the one in blue is July to July. Okay. So like in 2023, we had 944 pending sales. In 2024, in the month of July, we had 912 on okay. the books. Pending. Okay, but then you go back to 2022 and you're down roughly 100. Correct. And now 130 something. And 22 was, you know, one of the hot, hot months right. or years. So. Um, okay, so as we go into the next one, so 912 houses on the market right now. That are pending. That are pending. Typically, we would see, like in years past, that would be almost doubled. Almost double, yeah. Yeah, okay. So what slide do we go to next then? Do you Our guys? next one should be active listings. Okay, so that's where you see what your options are to choose from to then get it to that pending Correct. position. So or, or new listings. So uh, That's really the granddaddy issue here, isn't it? Yes. So new listings that came on in July, you know, we're at 1,300. That's up more. significantly though. That's 250 up. Yes, correct. So, you know, taking listings in July was one of the big pluses for uh, buyers mm -hmm. that want to be in a house before, say, um, Halloween. Right. Okay, so, so then from new listings, do you logically go to what? Y'all just go through the slides and we'll follow you. Okay, so they're the closed, closed sales. So, closed sales. Okay. So these are everything that had closed in July. Okay. Which is, is a little down um, from yeah. what we're used to, I should say. Uh, you know, in 2024, 895 homes closed. Mm -hmm. um, where if you go back and look at 22, you know, it was a little over a thousand homes sold. But if you're looking at how many closed versus how many were pending, you drop down about 15 or 20, 20 but that's just human error well no it anything. could be because if it went pending at the end of oh. june it could be a 45 day close so it's okay. going to close in august okay let's keep the optimism going yeah. though so from here where do we go next days, days on the on market. market that's big yeah that's and you know we're still at 34 35 days on the market depending on what area you're in as as a full whole this is Pulling uh, all of Hamilton County, Sequatchie County, Bradley County. So, call me weird, but I think that's better than a 10 day on the market sale. It is. It's, it's too fast. Correct. You don't have time to think about it, especially first time home buyers. You know, they. Yeah. This being their first home, it's. They want to talk it over with their mom and dad, right. their grandparents, their friends. Go so. see it a second time. Correct. Yeah, you don't want. That's a big, big purchase, and you don't want to do that. Uh, unthought out. Correct. Okay, uh, put my readers yeah. back on. Where do we go from here? <laughs> uh, our next one should be um, medium, medium sales. sales price. Um, from 23 to 24, uh, you know, it didn't go up $4,000. Mm -hmm. So, so this is the one that hurts. I'm going to pause here, even if we don't get to the other slides. We have a couple of minutes left. But if you're in, first of all, home ownership is about so much more than just making the mortgage payment Correct. and having an investment because a house was going to require money from you it is right things are going to break break and we've both felt it <laughs> we have lately yeah. uh, but if you have that nest egg saved 
and you're ready to buy. You can look at that and see how in the course of two years, homes go up, what, four and a half percent value? Yeah, so we, you know, you, you've got equity in it almost instantly. Almost instantly versus being in a rental where they're gonna also be raising your rent. Rent. Uh, there's a time and a place for everything. Correct. But waiting to buy the house, if you're ready, is if not a ready, good idea. If you're ready, it's time to go. Okay, um, we do have a minute left. Was there anything you wanted to hit that we didn't? Um, I, you know, if, if you're looking for a experienced realtor, I've got a team of four agents now. Let us help you. I, I just finished a awesome class that uh, we're going to be putting a lot of new uh, systems in play. Mm -hmm. So it, it's, it's, I'm excited about it. So I'm going to, I know you want to look ahead. But I'm going to tell a quick story on you as we go to commercial, okay? And okay. I show people how to get in touch with you. So, Onward Chattanooga was once the Mark Kite team. Yes. When Mark died, that team always has been very much a family, and it shook them all. And that team came to Jason and said, Jason, tag, you're it. You've yeah. got to be the one. So, I think you feel a little bit of, um, I think you're a little bit humbled. I am, and you know, it's some big shoes to fill. Well, Mark would end his emails with onward, yep. so that's why it's onward Chattanooga. So I know that you are very skilled uh, at you. your craft and you enjoy bringing that to your customers. I do. So here's where you find them now that you know the backstory. 805-9920 is their phone number, onwardchattanoogahomes.com. They're working the market to find the right one for you and your family and they will never hurry you. Nope. West Shell and Knife Trading Post has everything under the sun. First quality LVP click lock with 12 mil wear layer, nine great colors. Plus unbox click lock at $1 per square foot.